Hello, my name is Sarah. Today I'm going to be teaching you about one of the most commonly used English proverbs. You might have heard it before. Let's take a look at the board. When in Rome, do as the Romans do. So what does this mean? It's talking about when you go to another country, you have to adapt to that culture. So when in Rome, it's talking about ancient Italy. You don't really have to think about Italy when you use this proverb. You can be in any country, any city. Do as the Romans do. Again, it's talking about the local people. You can use this for anything. So when do you use this? When can you make use of this proverb? For example, if you go to another country, you go for the first time, you find it quite hard to adapt, you encounter something new. You might think to yourself, and you might use this proverb. For example, when I first came to Korea, I felt quite confused. I was staying with my friend for the first time and she was making me dinner. I thought, well, that's strange. She's not really getting up to do the dishes. Why is that? So I asked her, oh, maybe when I'm in Korea and I go to a friend's house, should I do the dishes when they make me dinner? She said, Maybe it's a good idea. And I thought, okay, let me go and do the dishes. So I was doing them and I was thinking to myself, oh, when in Rome, do as the Romans do. Now we've gone over the proverb, the full sentence. You might find that when you hear this in daily speech used by locals, they might not say the full proverb. For example, when you hear it, you might hear only when in Rome. But most people will know what the rest of it means, and it sounds more natural. So I have another example. When I went to Japan a few weeks ago, I was staying again with a friend of mine. It was evening time and we were about to have a bath. She got in first, she finished, and she came back out. She asked me, do you want to have a bath now? I said, yes, sure. I went in and I was about to empty the bath water because I thought, well, it's my turn, right? So she stopped me and came in and said, no, Sarah, in Japan, you're supposed to get in to save the water. At that moment, I thought, okay, that's a bit unusual. I'm not used to that, but when in Rome. We're going to have a look at some example dialogues to help you to understand how to use this proverb better. As you listen to these examples, please try to practice using it so you'll get a better feel for the proverb. Let's begin. Should we eat this food with our hands? Well, everyone eats with their hands here, when in Rome. In Japan, should I bow when I meet people? Yes, when in Rome, do as the Romans do. Nobody here is waiting in line. Everyone's just pushing to the front. Well, one in Rome, do as the Romans do. And there you have it, one of the most commonly used English proverbs. I hope you'll find really good use for this one. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. If you enjoyed this video, please let us know by clicking like, subscribe, or share it to your friends. Thank you.